en chirurgie, nous sommes confrontés à des maladies des valves cardiaques In cardiac surgery, we have to deal with heart valve diseases, which can't always be repaired. The best solution is to repair. Sometimes reparation is not possible because lesions are too serious. Et à ce moment-là, il faut remplacer la valve. À deux conditions. Premièrement, avec, si possible, une technique non invasive, ce qui est la tendance actuelle. In this case, we have to replace the valve with two options. The first, when possible, with a non-invasive technique, which is the current trend, and the second, with a reliable technique, which can ensure a result equivalent to surgery. The new Epigon bioprosthesis for transapical mitral valve replacement is conceived to provide superior clinical outcomes in patients with severe mitral regurgitation. The Epigon unique features include a monoleaflet pericardial tissue combined with a D-shaped annular ring. The asymmetric nitinol frame, with its anatomic anchoring systems, ensures a stable coupling below the mitral annulus, captures the native leaflets, and achieves optimal fitting and a low-risk LVOT obstruction. The Epigon concept allows to restore physiological blood flow into the ventricle and through the aortic valve. The natural asymmetry of the native valve generates a rotary flow in the ventricle, called the vortex, which minimizes energy loss and helps propel the blood directly into the aortic outflow track. After the insertion of a guide wire through the apex, the Epigon delivery system is advanced in order to ensure the optimal central positioning inside the native mitral valve using fluoroscopy and echo guidance. In the first step of the delivery, the atrial portion of the device is progressively released just above the annular plane. Under 3D echo view, the atrial pedals of the valve stent are deployed to obtain the correct D-shape rotational position. Using rapid pacing, the valve is now gently pulled toward the mitral annulus. The ventricle anchoring systems of the stent are then released below the annulus while two engagement arms capture the posterior and anterior leaflets to prevent LVOT obstruction. The Epigon transcatheter mitral valve prosthesis has the ability to restore the physiological blood flow in the ventricle and keep the native leaflets tendinous cordi under traction to prevent preserve left ventral function. The Epigon transcatheter mitral valve prosthesis has the ability to restore physiological blood flow in the ventricle and keep the native leaflets tendinous cordi under traction to better preserve left ventral function. Cette valve Epigon the Epigon valve remarkably meets both these specifications. C'est une valve introduite par voie non invasive et deuxièmement dont on a tout lieu de penser this valve is minimally invasive and there is every reason to believe that its results will be as good as surgery. I find this technology very interesting and highly innovative. Beaucoup s'y sont essayés, mais pour l'instant j'en ai vu aucun. Many companies have tried, but I can't find any other project as promising as the Epigon valve.